Hi, I'm with Martin here, who's just popped his head around the door, and um, we're talking about, we're getting clarity about what's the action for happiness in things, because you said you were interested in time banking, and I said, come and talk to me about time banking, but now you're talking about Kate Pickett, and tell me more. I'm talking about Kate Pickett, um, I've, uh, an author who's written a, a quite controversial book, um, mm -hmm. um, but the, the, the thrust of the book is, is that uh, inequality is the cause of, of unhappiness and, and all the, the stresses right. within society. And if we have a more equal society, or societies which are more equal... I think I've got this book. I lent it to a friend, Chris, about... It's called something like More Equal Society, or uh, Equality and... Well, be, it's yeah, got so, equality so in the title. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, uh, we could look it up. Yeah. Pickett would be spelled with a double T, would it? That's right, yeah. yeah. And... Um, they More equal society. are connected with the, they mm -hmm. sort of they set up something or it's going to be connected with something called the Equality Trust. Mm -hmm. Did you have a good session, Marcus? Yeah, good. What was it you did, you went to? And what did it do for you? Oh, loudly? Not loudly? Not it knocked you out, but that was a good session. That. You don't have to answer that. You don't, you don't, you don't have to answer that. You don't be incriminating. <laughs> 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 um, sorry for the brief. I just want to show that lots is happening here yeah, today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, Martin, do, do carry on. So, what's the effect that, uh, for, um, on you of what Kate's written? You, you, you liked her approach about more yeah, equal yeah, society I mean, uh, as, a, as a way to go? Yeah, this seems to be the way forward. I mean, it chimes with a lot of other agendas. The mm. green agenda, the sustainable agenda, the transition town agenda. The whole I want to have a conversation with you if you're, <laughs> if you're into the transition town agenda. Because mm, yes. I certainly am. Yeah, yeah. and want to see yeah. where it's going at present. Yeah. So Charles is here. Charles. Um, and um, next appointment, please. Charles, you ready for zero balancing? As ready as he'll ever be. <laughs> 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 you can put it in. Uh, bring just it give out. me the cup. Oh, that's, that's fine. That's fine. I'll have to find out all about zero balancing at some point. <laughs> well, <laughs> all the appointments are full for today for zero balancing, just as yoga was full with Nikki well, yesterday. Meditation tomorrow. Meditation is a standard thing that happens here yes. from two to four from the Bex Hill community. Now, I'm a long practicing Buddhist as well, um, 12 years, um, and right. asked for ordination in something called the Tree Ratna Buddhist movement, but I'm not qualified to teach meditation really. Um, sure. So, um, if you're interested in Buddhism and things, I'd love to have that conversation too, because yeah, yeah, yeah. I think there's three main parts to the happiness agenda that I've been talking about. Uh, one is the body mind agenda, uh, which Action for Happiness do quite quite well. Um, one is, I think, the represented by the film Economics of Happiness. Um, you saw it yeah. at the Electric Palace, yeah. right? Standing room only. All oh, right, you were, I didn't hand you a leaflet then because... I was right at the back. Yeah, uh, I, I was handing out leaflets to the first 30 people who turned up, which um, advertising this group and saying we were going to plan a good week. Um, so, yeah, I think there's a transition agenda. And I think the third major agenda is the spiritual agenda, represented most readily by this book by Mathieu Ricard, Happiness, A Guide to Developing Life's Most Important Skill. He's been put through machines and found to be the happiest man in the world. It's a lovely title to have. Um, <laughs> and he's a Buddhist monk. So I think I'm trying to bring those three agendas, realize that those three agendas exist, and try and create groups of people who, even if they've got those different.